Long Island, New York, an island even larger than the state of Rhode Island, is the home to the Islanders and their fans. Greetings, everyone, along with Eddie Olchek, Mike Emmerich. It is home ice advantage gone wrong. This team could be knocked out tonight, and these fans who are showing a nervous kind of raucousness could be watching their last game until fall. So if you're on the team that could go out, what are you thinking? Well, let's win the first period. Let's make sure that we play our very best in front of our fans and give ourselves a chance to get back on the road and get back in this series. And now we turn to the last lines of defense, the goalies. The pressure of the playoffs did him in last time, but he's back in there tonight looking for a chance of redemption. Off a victory in the last game, so a start in this one as this series continues. Two teams chomping at the bit. Let's get going. With Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro, Mike Ambrick, this playoff game has begun. Shoots. They score! Sidney Crosby! interesting guys after the first goal is scored whether the team that scored is going to continue to attack or whether they'll sit back a little bit the penguins strike first that's part of the plan take the crowd out of it and get one early a face-off win let's see what develops passing one off now to Gensel one into another. Well, we expected a physical game, Doc, and it looks like he's on a mission trying to set the tone for his team early in the first period. Point to point pass from the left wing. Tape to tape to center. To Bailey. Laid on to Lee. Pass. Good intercept in his own end. And he steps across the line. Couldn't do what he won. Fires! Score! That's his first playoff goal. A break in the coverage allows him to one time that puck from the low slot. He makes a good effort here, but it's not enough. The puck deflects off him and into the net. Under three minutes gone. Pittsburgh's got the lead in this game, two to nothing. They've won the faceoff. Can start the attack going in the zone. Up to the point. Chip to Kunov. Open ice collision. Well, that's a good open ice hit right there. You catch him with his head down just for an instant. You close the gap and finish the check. Let's it go. That puck hit him on the way to the net. The Penguins have it along the side at mid ice. Back in his defensive end to get it. Back to the point. A shot. May not have been intentional, but he got it anyway. What a save. Now that's a beautiful stop on a great scoring chance. Tripped up on the play, and there will be a penalty. Driving in from no man's land. Great defensive play with the stick. Fires a shot. A lightning-like club. Cranks the block. Bad save. Ooh, hard one there. Hornquist's headed to the penalty box. A minor for tripping. Now, this is a tough call. He was trying to play the puck, but he tripped up the attacking player. 
The Islanders are going to try out their power play. Just because it's your power play doesn't mean you can take a nap here. You have to work hard and continue to generate chances. Clears the zone. Snapping a pass to Lee. He's got that one. Let's see what happens. He's got that point pass. Shoots. No time to react. Didn't need it. Save. The shooter thought he had a chance, but the goaltender robs him. What a stop. Pittsburgh's taking advantage of the delayed call. The goalie is off. Outstanding save made off a terrific chance. And this penalty will wipe out the power play. New York's been assessed a minor penalty. Two minutes, and the call is tripping. He's got great stick positioning. Stick is on the ice, but unfortunately takes the skates out from under him. Four aside for the next little while because of the last penalty, penalty call. call. Man, I love four on four. One guy makes a little stumble or a half a mistake, and all of a sudden you've got scoring chances all over the place. Swatted down by Hornquist. Here's a one-timer and a save. He covers and has defused the attack for now. Nice face-off work. The Islanders have gotten out of their own end. Took that away in his own zone. Propelled to Crosby. Sends to the point. The Islanders have taken care of the penalty. Back at full strength. He wore that puck on a hard shot. Intercepted that one at an important place. Say, Omarov's tripped up. That should be a penalty. New York's in control of the puck up the wing. Leonard's at the bench. Extra attacker out. Swept aside. Pittsburgh's given a minor here for tripping. Oh, this is clearly a tripping call. He made no attempt to play the puck and took the legs out from the attacking player. New York's power play gets another chance to operate. Hasn't been effective yet. Well, you're not going to get an endless supply of power plays, but they get another one here. See if they can punch through. He just ran off. Really good job by the defenseman there. The Penguins shoot it back out. Got some time to check the clock and prepare to defend again. To the point it comes. Maneuvers his man in the zone. Shot. Outstanding point blank save. Now that's a solid save. It's out of the zone. Makes that play deep. New York's power play did not do it for them. And he steps across the line. Slid to Pavillier. Gets that pass in the corner. Off the mark. You're right, Doc. That one-timer was really close. However, the puck was just a bit behind him. It's a difficult shot. He missed one. Wonderful save. He was hovering right over him. Save with the pad. Couldn't make it through. Can't retain possession. Got to clear it. Blocked away. Out to the point. Directing that one to Hornquist. A whistle. Offside is called. Goalies have to make a half a dozen great stops in a win. This is one on a beautiful move, but there is nowhere for the puck to go. A little over four minutes to go, first period. The Penguins with the lead, 2-0. The face-off, the tie-up, and a solid job from the winger there. Has it in his own end. The Penguins are skating it up in neutral ice. That puck's loose, deflected away by Hickey. Slid back across from one point to the other. Pitching this one to Crosby. Sent that pass on ahead. Pitching it to Steven Gionta. 
using the point. Lost it, but got it back. Shoots. That's terrific goaltending. The goaltender shuts that one down on a superb opportunity. Nearing the final minute. And he holds on, and the whistle stops playing. You can't deliver the puck much better than that, but the goalie says no chance. That's an excellent save. Nice face-off win. Blockered away. Puck covered, whistle blown. Critical win of the draw. Springs it ahead to Grant. Stolen away in a clever play by Letty. On to Pula. Whistle is blown, and the guilty party heads off the ice. The Penguins get a two-minute penalty for tripping. This is an easy call for the official, Doc. Player made no attempt to play the puck and just tripped up the attacking player. This power play is too predictable. They have to find a way to change it up. Absolutely. I think you're right, Eddie. Let's see what the team does here. The Penguins with a face-off win. Pittsburgh's minor penalty is for delay of game. He was trying to play it off the glass, but he missed. The Islanders are presented with a great opportunity here. It's a long five on three. After an ineffective power play earlier in the game, let's see if they can get a little more organized, get the puck into the zone and get it on net far more frequently. Shoots one. A brilliant save at the horn. First period has been completed. And so intermission activities are forthcoming, but the players get a breather. The Penguins are up two to nothing. Stay warm and stylish at the rink with our specially priced item tonight. Our game team start priced in just 10 Pittsburgh's strength has been in goal scoring, and this one gave them a two-goal lead. That's the one they enjoy right now. We'll have more in a moment. New York's power play continues here as we're underway at the start of the period. Displays incredible skill with that move. Got it at the point. The Islanders go back so that they can come back on this power play. Crosses that line. Shoots one. Let's it go. Got a piece of that one. New players coming on for the Penguins. Pittsburgh's PK has been marvelous. They've done it again. I don't know how many more times they can. Seems like we're going to find out, though. Got that pass near the blue line and now looks ahead. Puts one on. Great save. Pass attempt to Grant. Puck is thrown to Letty. Takes that pass. Here we go. Robbery there. Still another save. What a show. Loose puck, not stick handled well there. Save there. Trying to go to Malkin. Steps in from the neutral zone. Look out, the hits are coming. Malkin's going to have to gather himself after taking that hit solidly. He was not aware of where everybody was. Now it's directed to Crosby. Shot on goal. That shot came from right in front. 
He had his eye on the puck the whole time. What a stop. Well, that's not challenging in the least. The goaltender's able to make the stop. He's got a clean line to see it. There's no challenge there. Over five minutes off the clock here in the second. Two goals have been scored, both by one team. Puck dropped in the log jam, and the winger reached in and got it. Moving it to Pavillier. Leads that charge into the zone. Flings it. Wow, what a glove save. New York's got that face-off win. In front! That's a good save and goal. They're going to have to come up with something better than that. Defensive zone win. Penguins wheel one ahead up the wing. Shoots one. Save! And decides to just cover it up and get the whistle. The Islanders with a clean win on the draw. New York's looking to head man up the wing. Feeds the point. Laid on to Boychuk. Rister from the slot. It's blocked. Pittsburgh's in their own end, hoping to make a play to center. Shoots. That shot came from just six inches. That was a good challenge. Better stop. The Islanders are at the wing in neutral ice. Chip to Brassard. Carries through center on the wing. Nice work by Eberle. Looking to Kunakel. Caroms it on to Eberle. Takes that pass in the corner. And down to Eberle. The pass is off the mark. What a chance that would have been. Skilled play by Eberle. Propelled to Grant. Gains the zone and looks over his options. Oh, what a terrific save in close. Puck covered, whistle blown. This is frustrating. The goaltender makes a save by getting just a chunk of the shot. That face-off from the tie-up, the help came. Passing one off now to Pavillier. Takes it to the corner. Has it back deep. The Penguins are driving it from the wing. Snapping a pass to Komarov. Gains that offensive line. This is tiring labor. Directing that one to Gensel. Goes to the backhand. That one goes well wide. New York's got it in their own end, hoping for center. In the slot. Shoots. At least he protected his goaltender. Into the end of attack. Reads the play and keeps it. The Islanders with a neutral zone possession along the way. Through the corner now. Picks it up back there. 
Nice play with the stick. Nothing more will come. They score! It's only a one-goal game now. Sure as well. I mean, the puck just kind of leaked through him on goal. The Islanders have gotten back to within one, and we're in the latter stages of the second period. Lots of potential before the horn sounds. I'm generally a guy that's entertained by lots of goals and low scoring games. Kind of bore me, but this has been pretty good. There's been chances, the goaltenders have been good, and it's been very physical. Kessels caught a stick up high, and the referee's arm is up. The Islanders get two minutes for high sticking. If he keeps his hands down, this is not high sticking. The Penguins' power play gets another chance to operate. Hasn't been effective yet. Well, their power play hasn't come through for them yet. Here's another opportunity. Score! The power play cashes in. got to get to this area of the ice. I think when he takes a look at this on video, he's going to see he was in really good position, and he just wasn't able to stop a perfect shot. The Penguins now have a two-goal lead, and we're late in the second period. Do they try to protect this at least to get to the horn? And they won the neutral zone faceoff. You win that, and you don't have to chase. They chase you. Really good cut of the pass. Oh my, is that not a penalty? 59 seconds. Got it right back. Good defensive read with that one. The Penguins get a minor penalty for charging. Well, we love speed, we love contact, but in this particular situation, you must slow up a bit before you make contact. If you do, there won't be a penalty, but here clearly, a charging call. There is hope with every man advantage, even if your percentage is poor. That faceoff is won. Cranks a blast! Right to the point. May not have intended it, but it hit it. One-timer. Solid love save. One-timer. And on top of that, another great stop. What quickness side to side. As soon as the shooter drops his head to release the puck, he's already in the butterfly, and so he can turn that aside easily. Alexiak's blocked so many pucks over the last couple of games, you would think he'd like to stick handle one of them once in a while. Say! Makes the stop and holds for the whistle. Puck dropped, and the winger stepped in to help. That's big. Perfect pass. Great point blank save. And the referee's whistle has stopped play. Goalies have to make a half a dozen great stops in a win. This is one on a beautiful move, but there is nowhere for the puck to go. Critical face-off win at that point. Wonderful stop. Hangs on to that one for a stoppage in play. You can't deliver the puck much better than that, but the goalie says no chance. That's an excellent save.
face off and a solid tie up and help arrive. Good job. And that puck landed in the bench here. I've always loved to be able to flip a puck over the glass. You see the kids get so excited when they get their hands on a game puck. Puck three, roadblock by Everly. 40 minutes have been played. Some hits given, some shots fired. But let's see what they have in mind as we get closer to the start of the third period and crunch time. Two periods have played a busy time on the shot board. 23 for the Islanders, a lucky 13 for Pittsburgh. Fans take a look to the sky. The whole team that was rolling with prizes headed your way all intermission long. Gensel's goal was late in that period, and so his team goes to the locker room smiling with a two-goal lead as we head to break. third period about to begin the rear view mirror will help us with the first two and so will Edzo the Islanders have been a bit frustrated doc after two periods of play they are down on the scoreboard they have the prospects of a real hot goaltender in front of them and as their coach I would tell them to stay with it eventually you get one and then you get another and you'll be right back in this game slid to lead didn't go very well there who comes up with it Great opportunity, but the pass didn't connect. Brings it in for an attack. Pass cut. On to Lee. Hatchets one. Terrific save. Got possession. Pittsburgh skating in their own end, trying to get to the neutral zone. Gives it to the point. Let's it rip. And off target with that one. Oh, that shot exploded off the stick. Just over the net. Oh, and he misses. Well, that puck slowed up. It just missed the side of the net. Pitching this one to Lee. Gains the zone. Fires. Outstanding save with the glove. Just over three minutes have gone by. It's a 3-1 game. Clean win on the draw. The Penguins look to make a difference up the wing. Points it. A long scorcher. Oh, deflected away. Just couldn't make it. Stick used like a magic wand by Komarov. Dogged determination there by Hornquist. That diffuses the attack for now. Leonard's quick thinking allowed him to stop the play to slow down the pressure. It's dropped. They lock up, and that's a good shot by the winger. Skates it into the zone. Let's it go. You can almost count that one, but no. Can't get it on net. That's a good scoring chance. He's trying to be too fine, trying to pick the corner. Sometimes you've just got to shoot it at the middle of the net. The Penguins through the neutral zone have possession. Gathered up again by Hornquist. Nice keep at the blue line so the attack can continue here. The stick can break up a play, and it just did. Strong defensive play. Carries it on in from center. Puck covered, whistle blown. The Penguins bench really got excited when they saw their goaltender make that amazing stop.
from the faceoff, and they lock up in a good reach. That's help from the wing. It's dumped in. Close in play. Wonderful save. What skill by both goalie and shooter. That great save was all positioning. Oh, a save there. The Penguins wheel it up the wing. He's got that pass at the point. Oh, and he's hammered. We saw him coming just at the last minute. He's able to spin off, but that's a big hit. Broken stick couldn't take it. No worse feeling, Doc, to break your stick with that opportunity. Pittsburgh's up the wing, controlling play now. Scooped up by Boychuk. Pitching it to Pellick. Pass attempt to Dumoulin. Takes it in from the neutral zone. Good place to shoot from. And holds on to that puck to get the whistle. Pittsburgh's fans got back on their feet after watching the replay of that massive save on the big board. I don't think we're going to see a bigger save than that the rest of the night. Good job on the draw. New York's got it and moving up the wing. Laid on to Lee. Cut that pass in his own end. And he dumps it in. Gathered up by Letty. Chip to Bailey. Let's it go. Oh, and he missed the net. There's not really much place to go with the shot. He's trying to be perfect. He misses, and the puck rings around the boards. Gathered up again by Bailey. Collision. You thought they were gone. They're not. Puck is thrown to Lee. Heads along the boards. Puck loose. Just a speed bump off the defense. Really solid job done defensively. That takes some of the pressure off when you can use your stick like that. Hoisted wide to Everly. Score! They're back to within one. Feeling. The score goal anyway is fun, but to get one on your birthday adds a little bit more to it. The Islanders are now back to within one with the scoring of that goal. And there's plenty of time for one more goal in the third. Pittsburgh's got that puck off the draw. Trying to go to Kunak. Right into the slot. Now it's directed to Malkin. Solid work there by Letty. Steps across that line. Good, solid defensive play with the stick. Bumped off. The Penguins with possession in the neutral zone. He throws it there. Right in that catching glove. Good work. Well, that's not challenging in the least. The goaltender's able to make the stop. He's got a clean line to see it. No challenge there. Over three minutes remaining here in the period. They have scored, and so maybe there's momentum here. Off the faceoff, he ties his man up, and so the puck goes to his team. A shot! Stared him down and made the save. Looked like the net was open for a second, but he shut it down. Has a chance to make a play through the corner. Moving it to Rust. In with it now. Terrific determination by Philpola. And in flight over the line. Propelled to Philpola. Looking to Hornquist. 
slid to Johnson. Passing one off now to Rust. Cut that pass in his own end. That's a bad turnover, Doc. When you're ahead, that puck has to be moved into a safe area of the ice 100% of the time. Pittsburgh's carrying it through center. To Clutterbuck. Good defensive play. Loose puck, though. Takes that pass. Shutout positioning by Hickey. And a save. Shot. Wonderful save. He was hovering right over it. Great display of goaltending right there, Doc. Oh, great defensive play to intercept. Snapping a pass to Johnston. Shot. The Islanders go for broke. Their goalie is pulled. Got it on his stick in the slot. Final seconds of round number one out of four. The Stanley Cup winner of this round is the team that traveled to get here. They haven't reached the ultimate yet, but this is an enormous step. They have clinched this series. Fans at home, Doc, will be celebrating tonight as their team wraps this series up. the tournament moves closer to its conclusion, we hope you'll anticipate the next games as much as we do. This one was fine for us tonight. We hope you enjoyed it, and good night for all of us.